Oh, motherfucker with the shotgun. Where'd he come from? Oh, my God. This is retarded, this part. Okay. Now that I'm here, I can't go back. Uh, okay, this guy will do me some favors. Should we go with a shotgun coming soon? Did I kill them all? <sighs> oh, there's a guy with a grenade launcher. I should have stuck with a Tesla gun and picked up ammo. I think because I started off with the grenades, I took out a whole bunch of them. Because I saw like they were all kind of gathered together, so I just went for the grenades. Do not let him through. Oh, what the fuck! This is ridiculous. Is actually, I, I hate this gun, but when you use it heavily, it's pretty amazing. I'm reloading, I'm fucked. Dead. Oh, stop it! Stop reloading!
Oh fuck. Oh, I'm gonna fucking die. Behind me. Actually, you know what? I did take this for a reason, right? Like, what am I, you dumb? Right, you're gonna be low on the fuck ahead in a second. Like, I had, I had this gun. Stop moving, dude. Jeez. I have this big motherfucking gun, yet I fucking take my sweet ass time. Sometimes I feel like I'm retarded. What's in that room? Nicola. Just the man I wanted to see. Oh. How may I help you, Sir Lucan? Come with me. We have money to discuss. Yes, sir. Damn you, Alistair. I guess that's Alistair Crowley or something. Fuck, I don't know. So I don't have to get in here at all, I guess. Okay. What am I doing? Tesla. Nicola, what happened? Lady Lakshmi was right. He knew. I'll get you out of here. Nothing we can do. There's still something I must do. Whoa. Alistair! I knew you would return, brother. Out of the shadows, damn you! I'm pumped. This looks you great. I, we are not that different. I do what I must to protect. You fuck country. dogs, bro. We, we are different. Only for our right to live. That's a lie. One day, perhaps, you will understand. Hey, whoa, 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 I, I need the gun. Give me, Grayson. This is not the outcome I sought. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, balls. He's turning into a dog again. He's ripped too, fuck. Is this what you wanted? This is what I wanted, motherfucker. Oh. I forget, I forget, I forget. Fuck you. What? Oh shit. Oh shit. Ah, too slow. In the face. Oh, too slow. Damn it, wow, so close. Whew. Hope I went to like an objective. Oh shit. Nah, just kill me, kill me. I, I fucked up too much. Cause there's something on the floor. I don't know what that is. Uh, and I, I tried to access it, and it be, made everything worse. I'm just gonna I'm not gonna fuck around, and I'm just gonna do it straightforward. I'm trying to play too cool. Oh, what the fuck? But oh, we're gonna get him! He's uh... No, no, no brakes, no brakes. Brakes. I would take that electric gun and fucking shove it up his ass and pull the trigger. A dick. I've lived too long to not know this day would come. Why, Alistair? You have forced us outside all these years. I've seen things I am condemned to remember. Civilizations born and destroyed by humanity's incessant greed. The pride of men. <laughs> Slaughtering each other in the name of their so-called God. We will atone for our sins in time. But how can you justify the atrocities your kind have committed? My kind. My kind are no more evil than yours. What of your sister? Your father? Was it all a lie? Is he? My father. <laughs> I love them as my own blood. But they cannot begin to know the curse I have lived with. My son. Father. Forgive me. It is I who needs your forgiveness. I never meant this life for you. You knew. I have always known. I rescued him from the massacre of his family. Your father died by my sword. But a child? 
You didn't deserve such a fate. How could I have taken the life of an innocent? Confess this to the Council, Lord Chancellor. It is the only way to make amends for the havoc that has been unleashed. I cannot! The revelation would shake our order to its very foundations. Everyone's an asshole so in this game. Sacrificed. How many more must die to ensure an eternal silence? He is my son. I cannot be the one to end his life. Isabeau and the council must ah. never discover the truth, lest all you hold dear. I can't. I can't horses. kill dogs, man. I can't do it. Henceforth, I like dogs. You shall have fellowship with no knights. The order must remain united. You're you fucked are up. No bro. longer. One of its heralds. Finish what you have begun and vanish. I will shoot him first and then kill Men the kid. Men were never meant to live this life. There shall come a day when all our burdens will end, brother. <laughs> no. Maybe then we shall know true peace. I'm not killing him. <laughs> do I have the option? What if I don't do anything? Okay, fuck, it's taking too long. Uh, why do I have to do it? Doesn't make sense. <laughs> Don't do it. Don't do it. Do I have an option to not do it? Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Okay, so he's not going to put the gun down. I do want to see him shoot in the face, so... That was cool. Ah, oh, so it's done. Fuck, I wanted to kill the vampire, man. But what a fucking game, man. Unbelievable. So, uh, quick thoughts. I'm gonna get my quick thoughts on this game. And I think I have a lot to say. I might be wrong, but let me start off by saying... Okay. Okay. So. Let's start off with the good. Visually speaking, this is probably the best looking game out there, bar none. There is nothing that looks better in this game, at least to my knowledge. And uh, I, I look at games every day. It's what I do. I read about them. I play them. I care about them very much like most of you folks do. So I haven't seen anything that looked this good. And I am... It is a marvel. Like, I'm amazed to see 
the amount of detail that they put throughout the game, the textures, the the fucking the characters. I mean, it is truly, 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 truly amazing. And I think this will be like the best looking game. I even when Uncharted Four comes out, which probably will be the better looking game. But I mean, up until then, I don't see anything that's coming up that can beat it. So that's pretty, pretty. Pretty great, considering that this team, Ready at Dawn, only made PSP games, and this is their first take on console games, which is fucking crazy. So it's pretty cool. Um, now, the complaints about the game, reviewers have been complaining about the length of the game. The length's okay. I mean, if you if you're a pussy and you play this game on fucking easy, sure, sure the game will be done in like five to six hours long. Um, but you know what i mean it's not a long game to begin with but what i do feel is that they went for a more cinematic kind of thing so this game is very very like very much like a movie and props to them on that because they got the feel right the fucking environments are fucking beautiful and it's very dark and chaotic so if this thing was a movie it'd fucking win the oscars not not even the oscar if this movie this game came out fucking five weeks ago it would have fucking won every fucking oscar award because movies suck balls now but um no this game is very very good uh in, in terms of gameplay um i mean it's a linear shooter um the controls are very good they're tight probably not the best shooter third person shooter i've ever played but i mean uh the gameplay is good the weapons are interesting they have you know the electric gun and so the grenade launcher and you know it's kind of like gears of war except you know headshots one or one shot kill it's it's a lot of fun the the controls are tight i i played it with auto aim off i don't know how it is with auto aim on and i'm sure like it helps but um the, the complete control that i had of of the shooting uh with auto aim off was was really good see like the, this is one also one of the shortest credits i've ever seen Sir Galahad, the whole of London is looking for you. We mustn't delay. Sir Galahad, can you hear me? Sir Galahad. It's, it's not over. Never. All is fine. So you say, my friend. The council has declared martial law throughout the city. There is no telling when the authorities will decide to mount an offensive. Now is not the time for heroics. I would advise we follow Lady Lakshmi's lead and leave the city. I'll join you shortly. And don't you know, I'm Galahad no more. My microphone actually caught up. <laughs> My headphones actually cut off. So I missed like, I don't know, I missed like the last 20 seconds of that fucking dialogue. Fuck. Anyways, so going back to what I was saying. So the gameplay is pretty good. Now, I just want people to keep in mind that I think whatever Ready or Dawn was trying to do, they achieved it. They made a very, very, very detailed game. The, the Maybe not so much in terms of gameplay, it's a solid shooter, you can't really knock it on it because it is incredibly solid and mind you, bug free. I haven't seen a fucking bug in this game. Maybe some pop in but super rare and it was barely noticeable. But it was, it was fucking clean. It's a great, great game. Uh, so, Vinko actually brought up a good point. A viewer over here saying, "Sick game though. Can't make it 20 hours when every inch is perfected." And that is, I wholeheartedly agree with that. This game had has so much to it, so much detail. The the art, everything that that was utilized, put this thing together. It's the music. Everything is fucking great. So, 
those are my thoughts. You can watch my playthrough, or I highly suggest you get this game because once you feel it and you play it, and you'll never get the, the, the same look I'm getting. You'll never get it on a video. You'll, you'll never see how really, really, really beautiful this game is. The only way you can do that is on your TV, when you see it in real time. It is unbelievable. Um, the, the little intricate details and everything, it's just fucking mind-boggling. So, my, my, my point to reviewers is, is, is this. Fuck them, okay? I, I respect their opinion to a degree. They could say the game's a four or five. It's these these reviews don't even really matter. It's it's all subjective, anyways. To me, it was a fantastic game. I enjoyed it thoroughly. And my only fear and the only thing that pains me, and this is something I brought up with my friends before, is that I would hate that this game, because it got such a bad review, that it would affect its future releases. So Ready or Dawn may have some problems with Sony. Sony might not want them to make the next game. And it's not even their fucking fault. It's just like they made a game that they wanted to make. And it, it in no way is a bad. You could you could see what the intention is. You, 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 you could, when you play it, you could fucking really, really dive in and feel that this world is real. It's insane. So I, I hope this does not affect Ready Yet Dawn. They should definitely